What's going on guys? Today I'm going to do a quick review of the Wallabot. Uh, in this review I'm going to tell you everything that you need to know about this device, including one thing that you should know before buying. I should mention this is the Wallabot DIY 2. Um, but yeah, pretty cool product overall. So I've actually been testing out different stud finders to see which one I really liked. This one is really unique in that it truly does let you um, actually see through walls. It's it's pretty crazy, uh, the technology overall. Uh, not on the cheaper uh, side of things. I think that uh, most folks would agree with me on that. But it can be very, very helpful um, in that it would help you, like for instance, one time I accidentally drilled into some PVC pipe, didn't want to do that, drilled right into it, I thought it was a stud, that can be a problem. Um, and then the other thing I like a lot about this is that it actually will uh, be able to find, like with an infrared technology, it actually can find uh, rodents and things that are in the wall. That is pretty neat because if you have, you know, you're suspecting something, you're hearing something, you might be able to use this to actually figure out if, you know, what you think is happening is actually happening. And that detects metal and wood uh, and also wires, etc. So I'm going to show you this against the wall in a second. But, you know, overall compact size, not very much different than a regular stud finder. Um, this is the side that you put on the back of the wall or on the wall, I should say. This side is just the front side right here. The power, oops, the power is right here, this little button, just to turn it on. And right here is the little charging cable that it comes with uh, to charge it up. And uh, yeah, there's no batteries otherwise in here. It's just a rechargeable battery that you can use. Okay, so this actually comes with with an app. And what you do is you put it against the wall, you put it in a circular motion, and then it will scan and show you what's actually in the wall. Okay, so let me go ahead to the wall here. Okay, so connecting it to your phone through Wi-Fi, super easy to do. Basically, just install the app, press a button, and it will automatically connect. doesn't take much. We're going to go ahead and put it against the wall here, right? And we need to calibrate it, right? So right now, we put it firmly against the wall. We'll press next step. And excuse me as I start doing this with one hand. Now we're going to start the calibration. Here we go. And now we just want to move it in a circular motion. It shows you when you move it in a circular motion because it's calibrating, right? Right now it's calibrating. And we are ready to go, okay? So now it knows what the wall is like. We've calibrated it, right? So now this is pretty cool. So right now, no object detected. So I'm gonna take it, I'm gonna move it over to here, okay? To the edge of the wall. And right now, you can see that it is detecting a wooden stud, which would make sense. That wood would be behind here. Now I'm going to drag it. This is an electrical thing here, so we're going to drag it over. Now right here, which is right above the electrical, it's actually detecting, well, it says metal stud. That's a pipe, most likely. Um, so not necessarily perfect, but does let you know, hey, it's right there. Uh, and then right next to it is the wooden stud. So it actually does exactly what it says it's gonna do. It lets you see through the walls, which is a pretty cool technology. Now, when you disconnect from it, um, or when you turn it off, I should say, it basically says, hey, do you wanna join again? You'll have to join to the network. All you have to do, you just pair it to pair this. Like I said, you just turn it on, you turn on your phone and it'll work. Now, the things to know about this, uh, which I thought were pretty interesting. So there's really two things. So first off, they specifically say the charging cord that comes with this, okay, which is just a simple run-of-the-mill, I'm grabbing it here, simple run-of-the-mill charging cord, okay, nothing special to it. They say specifically, do not use any other charging cords with it. I mean, this is a common charging cord, but what I would say is, obviously the price is important, use their charging cord. I wouldn't risk it. The second thing that I want to point out, and this is one little thing I don't like, so the calibrating can be a little rough on the wall. So we have textured walls. You see these little white spots right here, right? When I'm circling this thing on my wall, if you have texture walls like we do, right, it can basically take off little pieces of paint, which is definitely a little bit annoying. Um, not the end of the world, but just something to be aware of. So yeah, overall, I mean, the Wallabot, it is really, really cool. I think it's really cool technology, the fact that you can actually see through the walls, see the different materials. Like I said, I wish I would have had this when I drilled into a PVC pipe, uh, but I didn't, so it is what it is. But uh, yeah, so this is a really cool uh, device, cool technology. Overall, really good um, runtime, you know, battery. I mean, I haven't had to change this thing yet. We've had it for about a month. I've used it, you know, a handful of times. I haven't had a problem with it. But uh, otherwise, yeah, definitely recommend it if you're not sure if it's for you. Uh, it, it definitely is a quality product. Recommend it and hope that you enjoy.